Hi, welcome back to the Morning Minute, brought to you by Road ID. Neil Rogers here with Andy Hood, start of stage four. The cobblestones are behind us, but perhaps the effects of that stage, yesterday's stage, will be felt for the rest of the tour. How do you see stage three impacting all the way in Paris? Well, two major things I think came out of yesterday. Uh, Contador gaining time on Armstrong a day when perhaps Armstrong was certainly planning on getting time on Contador. And also, Frank Schleck out of the race. He's going to be really missed in the mountains. He was uh, Saxo Bank's second option. He won't be there to help uh, Andy, both in terms of psychologically as his brother, plus, of course, he's a very strong rider. Yeah, one less card for Saxo Bank to play. Let's go ahead and just quickly, how would you grade the performances of the top GC favorites? I'll take the easy ones. Uh, Cadell Evans, Andy Schleck in the front group, you got to give those guys 10 out of 10 on the day. A little further down, let's look at Armstrong, Contador, guys like Wiggins, what do you think? I think all those guys rode pretty good. I mean, Armstrong had that, that puncture. That's just bad luck. It's hard to give him a, a bad grade on that. I thought Wiggins got through good. Even guys like Menchoff was riding well. Sastre got through. He crashed, but he was right there with Contador. You know, I think really the big surprise of the day, though, has to be Contador. Everybody thought he was going to crash. Everybody thought he was going to lose time. And other than the, the break in the spoke and a little bit of a getting dropped there at the end, I mean, he he passed he, with, uh, with high colors. So I think at this point, Advantage Contador, everybody's talking about Evans. Is Evans, uh, does he have a realistic chance to win this tour? Oh, Evans is in the best situation he's ever been in a Tour de France right now. Normally he's off the back, especially after a team time trial. He's right in the front row. All right, well, stage four, it's short, it's sunny, it's hot. There's supposed to be a tailwind, most likely one for the sprint. We'll be back tomorrow to talk about how that stage went and look ahead. That's it for the Morning Minute.